Hey everybody, this is Pastor Tyler Baker of Valiant Baptist Church, and we're located in the Jacksonville, Florida area. This is going to be part seven of the series entitled, Jesus is Jehovah, wherein I am proving from the Old and New Testament scriptures that Jesus Christ, who was born of the Virgin Mary, was in fact the one and only true God, Jehovah himself, manifest in the flesh. Now, one of the main characteristics of God is that he is eternal. He is the creator. And before he created everything, of course, he had to exist. So he has always existed. He is the beginning and he is the ending. He is the first and he is the, the last. He is, like the Bible says, and Jehovah himself says at one point, he inhabits eternity. He is eternal. So he's always existed. Now, of course, we wouldn't be surprised to see Jehovah saying this, the God of the Old Testament. Isaiah 44, 6 says, Thus saith the Lord, that's Jehovah, the King of Israel, and his Redeemer, the Lord of hosts. I am the first and I am the last, and beside me there is no God. Now, of course, the Bible teaches monotheism. There is only one God. Well, that one God says that he is the first and he is the last. Talking about it, he is eternal and he's by himself and there's no one else that shares this characteristic. That's, of course, what he's stressing in this verse. But I want you to hang on to that statement. He says this, I am the first and I am the last. Isaiah 48, 12 says this, Hearken unto me, O Jacob and Israel, my called, I am he. I am the first, I also am the last. Now again, we see Jehovah making the statement, I am the first, and I am the last. Also, if you remember from one of our earlier episodes, Jesus made that same exact statement, I am he. Of course, again, identifying himself as Jehovah. But not only that, if we look in the book of Revelation, Revelation chapter number one, verse number 11, Jesus speaking, he says this, saying, I am Alpha and Omega. And then he says this, the first and the last. And what thou seest, write in a book, and so forth and so forth. Now, did you notice what Jesus said? He said that he is the Alpha and the Omega. What does that mean? The beginning and the ending. What else did he say? He said, I am the first and I am the last. Well, what did Jehovah say? He said he is the only God and he is the only one that is the first and the last. Jehovah is the first and the last. And what did Jesus say he was? That he is the first and he is the last. And by the way, you can't have two people that are the first and two people that are the last. You can only have one first and one last. If there was two, that would make one person the first, one person the second. One person the last, one person maybe second to last. There is only one first and there is only one last and that is the one and only true God, Jehovah. And Jesus says, hey, I am the first and I am the last. You know what that means? That Jesus is Jehovah. There is no disputing this clear truth in the Bible, my friend. And that is that Jesus Christ, who was born of the Virgin Mary, was the first and the last manifest in the flesh. He was Jehovah of the Old Testament, the God of the Old Testament, born as a man. God bless you and have a good day.